tennis is a very inclusive sport. Um, we've um, been um, developing um, the sport of table tennis to involve people with disabilities since 2009. So over the last uh, five years, we were very successful in, um, uh, in involving the people from the deaf community and uh, some of their um, players have actually come and uh, become members of our national team. So that's a very big achievement for them. Unfortunately, they don't. Uh, they are not classified under the normal para sports. As a deaf um, athlete, they don't come under para sports. Uh, since last year, we have actually grown out, gone out of our way to try and include other people with other disabilities, um, especially in the wheelchair um, categories and also in the um, standing categories where people are computers or have, have uh, disabilities involving their limbs. Uh, we've gone in partnership with um, with uh, Oceania Table Tennis in setting up what they call the, the PSP program for people with disabilities. Over the last uh, few months now, the, the, the players that we've selected have been training quite seriously and I believe some of them actually have uh, medal potentials in the Pacific Games. Uh, this is the first time they're having um, table tennis uh, with disabilities in the Pacific Games and we are planning to send four athletes. There's two women, one in the wheelchair category and one in the standing category and in the men the same events, one in the wheelchair and one in the standing.